All right, so the um, first question is, what is your name? My name's Amy. How old are you? I'm 24 years young. What, what? Um, where do you live? I live in New York. Um, and how, where have you lived um, ever? Have you lived anywhere else? I haven't lived anywhere else besides New York, so just New York. <laughs> Um, do you have pets, siblings, children? Um, I have four siblings and a dog. Um, let's see, what would you do if you won a hundred million dollars? If I won a hundred million dollars, I would, um, probably used to go, to go on a shopping spree, maybe give some money away to charity, um, but probably mostly for shopping, <laughs> or for, um, to further my YouTube career by probably getting a fancy camera, because right now I'm on my Mac webcam, so probably fancier camera, you know, that kind of stuff. Um, what magazines do you subscribe to? Um, the only magazine that I'm subscribed to is Glamour Magazine, and I love Glamour, so great magazine. Um, my favorite TV shows are, um, my favorite TV shows, oh god, are as follows. Glee, New Girl, American Idol, X Factor, um, let's see what else, Once Upon a Time, can't wait for that to come back, I'm so excited. Um, you know what else, I love Modern Family, I love, I just, I like any funny TV show, so, um, I love The Timothy Show, I love Friends, I love Full House, so, I mean, like, Full House is such a great show, and I still have, like, seasons four and five on DVD, so, I still watch it, and it's still funny to this day, like, the comedy is just, like, <laughs> it's just amazing, so, I love it, and also John Samos is not too bad to look at, so, hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Um, my favorite YouTubers, besides Buck, of course, um, he, Buck was actually, fun fact, one of the first YouTubers I ever subscribed to, ever, and, um, he just kind of paved the way for other people that I should be watching, so, um, yeah, so now I really love, um, Jay Carl, Charles Trippy, Cole Jeffrey, Cole Jeffrey, who I've actually am internet friends with, I like to think so, I've known him for like four years, it's kind of scary, <laughs> and we haven't, we've never met in person, it's a little weird we should though, VidCon 2013 anyone? <laughs> um, let's see, what else, um, let me think, who else do I watch, Toby Turner, Olga K, Shane Dawson, of course, <laughs> if you guys know me at all, you know, I'm obsessed with Toby Turner and Shane Dawson, especially, um, I love Brittany Louise Taylor, Juicy Star of Seven, I like Letters 21, Mac Barbie of Seven, um, Miss Glamorazzi, I love Miss Glamorazzi, she's really great, um, let's see, who else do I watch, oh, god, I don't know, many more, <laughs> many more, um, What's your favorite song right now? My favorite song right now is the Glee version of Oops, I Did It Again. And if you haven't heard that song, if you haven't seen the episode yet, links will be below because it is the greatest, greatest version of it. Oh my god, I love it. And um, I also love anything by One Direction right now, so I really love them. They're so cute. I mean, come on. <laughs> it's pretty good, One Direction. Oh, they're so cute. Um... What are you most proud of in your life? I am most proud of, um, let's see, back in 2009, I auditioned for a little play called Bye Bye Birdie, and this is my college, um, and I was part of the drama club there, and the director, who I was really close to, um, I felt like she definitely encouraged me. She was like, you know, you need to do this, so, because I've always sort of been in the ensemble, like the background and other plays, and, um, you know, I thought it was, like, sort of my last year being at that college before, I, you know, I was going to, like, graduate with associate's degree, blah, blah, blah. Long story short, <laughs> I signed the climb for my audition, and, um, and then, like, after, like, I was finished, it was like, oh, my God. <laughs> like, I knew that was in you, but, like, oh, my God. <laughs> and I was like, really? Because, you know, I'm just, I'm, I feel like I'm kind of modest when it comes to singing. Like, I know I'm a good singer, but I know I'm not, like, Alicia Keys good, so. Yeah. So I'm not Alicia Keys good, but whatever. It's okay. Who needs to be Alicia Keys? <laughs> I mean, she's amazing. I love Alicia Keys, but, you know. Anyways, so um, she actually gave me a hug, and she was like, that was really good. Um, she gave me a hug and everything, so it was awesome. And she said that I got every note right, so 
what the fuck if you're watching this the clem is not that hard to sing okay it's not <laughs> me and you should just have a sing off all right and i'm sorry if i'm looking down i'm looking at the questions because i wrote them down see this is what i do <laughs> um all right where were we um what kind of a friend are you um i feel like when it comes to being a good friend, I am very caring, trusting. Like, you could probably tell me a secret and I'll forget about it. Like, literally, <laughs> I'll forget it. Or sometimes, well, I feel like sometimes I feel like I tell people and I kind of gossip about it, but I don't like to do that. I try not to do that because I feel like that's really mean girlsy and I don't, I don't like to have that mean girls attitude, but um, I don't know. I'm, <laughs> I don't know. I hate to, like, gossip, but I do that and I find myself doing that and I feel like that's kind of, like negative but I feel like I'm a very trusting person anyway because I mean like literally if you need to like if it's a serious secret then I will keep it and I'll probably forget about it later and then you'll talk to me about it later and I'll be like what oh <laughs> I forgot about that so that's pretty much and then um I feel like I'm just a really good listener and going back to sort of telling me something like if you tell me something and um you know, and, and, and if it's personal and stuff, like, that conversation will stay between me and you, and that's not going to go anywhere else besides, you know, anywhere. Because even in my tiny chats, like, what happens if you're, you know, our conversations stay there. <laughs> they stay there. They're, they're, I'm not going to go on Twitter and talk about what, you know, Bailey said. I'm not going to be like, well, Bailey said this. Like, I mean, even though, because I feel like tiny chat is, like, Tosh, Bailey's, and I's, um, you know, little, like, bitch fest, <laughs> I guess you could say so, um, but I'm having one tonight, actually, so if you guys want to come, links below, and we have fun, and we like to bitch about stuff in life, and, you know, yeah, um, and also describe your personal style, well, as you can see, I'm very, like, comfortable right now wearing a t-shirt, but, um, I do love to wear skinny jeans, and, um, I love, I love jeans, though, in general, I like flary jeans, um, I love, let's see, I love, like, a good pair of, um, ballet flats, I love flip-flops, um, I love going to Breadfruit 21 and just, like, trying on shoes and looking at everything and wishing that I could own it all, and actually, the other day, I tried on this, like, really cute little black dress, and I wanted to buy it, but it was, like, 30 bucks, <laughs> and I was like, I don't know if I should buy it, because, you know, really, what am I gonna wear it for, so, I ended up buying, buying it, but I still have my eye on it, and I'm still thinking about it, so, yeah, so basically Forever 21 and also American Eagle is a really cool store, so I like going in there and just, you know, buying everything again. <laughs> and, um, yeah. And then for the bonus questions, um, for this, so this is more what the buck related, because this is kind of just feedback that he wants from us, especially people that watch his videos, like May, that watch them all, like, every week and, you know, all the time. So, um, what are your favorite what the buck show topics? My favorite what the buck what the Buck show topics are, um, probably everything he talks about. <laughs> Anything that I'm thinking about, like, whenever he covers the Emmys or any award shows or, um, or when he's talking about One Direction or what Kim Kardashian did over the weekend. Like, I love when he comes to the Kardashians. I think it's hilarious. And I love that we both hate them. Like, I hate them because of him. <laughs> I'm like, I know, it's so true. They're ridiculous. <laughs> but yet I still sometimes find myself watching their show, which is really bad. But I don't follow them on Twitter anymore. Like, every single one of them, I don't follow. I swear to God. Like, I unfollowed them and I was so happy. <laughs> and I also love that on um, What the Buck said on Life with Kelly that his musical inspiration was Beyonce and his favorite Kardashian was another film. That's like my new favorite line. <laughs> okay, I just spoke really fast. But anyways, so um, let's see. Least favorite What the Buck show topics. Um, I don't know if I have a least favorite. I don't really know. I guess whenever he's talking about something that I don't understand. But there's nothing that he doesn't talk about that I don't understand. Or that I don't know, like, what he's talking about. So, I don't know. That's kind of a hard one. And I feel, I don't have any, like, I like everything he talks about. So, I don't know. <laughs> um, let's see what else. And then the last one, should he break up topics into separate videos? I said no. I kind of like how things are going these days. I think they're just, it's awesome. I think it just keeps, it's like rapid fire. It's just, he says it, he makes a joke, it's all... I think it's just hilarious, and I like watching them all, even if it's, like, really long and it's, like, 15 minutes long or something, not that it ever has been, but if it is, I'd still watch it. I'd be like, okay, I want to get bored, <laughs> unless if it was, like, him just covering, like, Pretty Little Liars, which I don't watch. Oh, my God, don't hate me, <laughs> which I don't watch, but I feel like I might get into it. 
if um if I were to watch like the first episode and stuff but I kind of know what's going on just from like watching the ads and stuff like I kind of know but not really like I know there's a lesbian in there and I know Lucy Hill's like really pretty so I don't know <laughs> that's basically really pretty little liars for me and also um I'm very confused about who A is like is A the Allison girl that died or I don't know that that gets me really confused but maybe maybe I could get into it if any of you Pretty Little Liars fans like want to help me out and maybe have me watch like the first season or something I don't know let me know and yeah so that's it um that's the end of the tag the questions will be below and also I'm um, Michael Buckley if you are watching this follow me on Twitter like I said in the beginning of this video follow me on Twitter links will be below and right here again so follow me on Twitter and um yeah so hope you guys enjoyed this and i'll see you guys okay bye